So it's 1798. And the first bank of the United States has moved across the street. The Bank of Pennsylvania needs a new vault. They hire a man named Patrick Lyons to build this new vault. He does an okay job, but he was working really fast because he was trying to avoid the yellow fever epidemic. I don't know if you know anything about the yellow fever epidemic, but it was just bad. It wasn't good. So he worked fast and he got this job done fast and he left town. But no sooner had he left town than it turns out this vault was robbed. But what's crazy about this vault being robbed is that nobody actually broke into the vault. It's almost like somebody had a key to the vault. Well, when the people of Philadelphia heard this, they thought they knew who had robbed the bank. Patrick Lyons. So everyone accused Patrick Lyons, but Patrick, who had made his escape from Philadelphia, escaped the yellow fever. He was down in Delaware, he heard about this. He rushed back to Philadelphia to clear his name. No sooner had he arrived in the city than he was immediately arrested. He, per he professed his innocence for months and months, claiming that it was in fact a man named Isaac Davis who would come in to watch him build this new vault. He thought he was very suspicious. He told the police to look for Iv Isaac Davis. They're like, yeah, sure, whatever. They sort of looked for him. Well, it's funny because Isaac Davis sort of came to them because Isaac Davis was caught trying to deposit the money he stole from the bank into the money he stole, into the bank he stole the money from. But what's really crazy about this is that Isaac Davis did not go to 